As you know, crypto prices are still falling. Day by day, they try to recover but then fall again. And you guys must be wondering how to make money in such times. Don't worry, as today, our topic is to teach you 8 other ways to make money with NFTs. If you want to know all about it, then stick around until the end of the video. Let's get started without any further delay. If you remember what an NFT is, that's great. If not, let's go over it quickly. NFT stands for Non-Fungible Token. A non-fungible token is a digital asset that can't be duplicated or changed. These tokens can be thought of as a digital version of artwork from a private collection. Each piece of art in the collection is unique and valued at a different amount. An NFT can be sold for cryptocurrency or fiat currency just like a piece of art. The token's asset transfer, like bitcoins, is recorded in the blockchain. This establishes who owns a particular NFT. Furthermore, the value of an NFT is determined by consumer interest, just as it is for works in our hypothetical art collection. The rarity of the item and the number of potential buyers are important factors in determining its value, just as they are with trading cards. Although an image can be converted to an NFT, there are no restrictions on copying or sharing it. The blockchain, on the other hand, stores and clearly shows who owns the asset ownership of NFTs, making it impossible to forge. One of the major drivers of its value is the euphoric feeling of having exclusive ownership. Reselling is the most common way for people to make money and increase the value of their NFT. So, let's get back on topic with our first way of making money with NFTs, and that is renting out your NFT. As you know, NFTs cannot be copied. But did you know that you can rent them out? The renting process is straightforward. It works similarly to leasing and collecting rent on a real estate property. Renting an NFT entails lending it to someone for a specified period in exchange for a fee. Renting out NFTs is a good way to make money without having to give up ownership. After renting comes royalties. I'm sure you're wondering if royalties can be earned from something as intangible as an NFT, but the answer is yes. Even after selling a digital asset to someone else, the creator can continue to earn royalties for the rest of his or her life. The creator, however, must impose these terms, and if someone buys the asset you developed, you will receive royalties for the rest of your life. And royalties are an excellent source of passive income for artists. While royalties may appear confusing at first, they're worth considering when it comes to making money from NFTs. The third way to earn from NFTs is another popular way, and that's not selling but trading NFTs. Some entrepreneurs and investors treat NFTs as if they were stocks, buying and selling them to profit. So if you have a collection of NFTs that you no longer need, you can easily sell them just like you would if you made them yourself. Only the minting procedure will be skipped. Buying and selling NFTs can be a profitable investment strategy, in less than six months to be exact, for example, Pablo Rodriguez Fraile, who is a Miami-based art collector, flipped a Beeple digital art piece for nearly 1,000 times its original price. But that's not the case with every NFT as not all NFTs are created equal. Some NFTs are nearly worthless, while others are worth millions of dollars. As a collector, you must scrutinize an item for the possibility of profiting from resale in the future. This is why you shouldn't just follow the influencers or accept their offers but do thorough research about who is behind them. What's the plan and what's the level of scarcity and base price in a project? This is the only way by which you can avoid fraud. But when it comes to trading NFTs, however, knowing when to sell is essential. Making money from NFTs through trading may appear risky to some, but the payoff can be well worth it. The object, the reason for purchasing it, and whether or not there is any interest in the item in question all influence the selling time. After trading NFTs comes NFT gaming. We now live in a time when it's possible to earn money by playing video games. In blockchain-based games, NFTs are a type of cryptocurrency that can be used to buy and sell in-game items. There are already some extremely rare and expensive collectibles on the market, such as those found in the game CryptoKitties. After CryptoKitties came Axie Infinity and their NFTs went to thousands of dollars too and the trend is still going on which you can also adopt. After NFT gaming, we have NFT staking. 
Yes, you heard it right. Just like renting your NFTs, you can also stake your NFT, and that's pretty easy too. And this is one of the benefits of combining NFTs and DeFi protocols. And if you don't know what staking is or haven't done it earlier, let me explain to you that staking is the process of depositing or locking away digital assets in a DeFi protocol smart contract to generate a yield. And speaking of platforms which support NFT staking, so some platforms allow you to use any NFT, while others require you to purchase native NFTs to receive staking token incentives, which are usually priced in the platform's native utility token. Examples of platforms that facilitate NFT staking are Kira Network, NFTX, and Only One. If you made it this far and if you haven't already, now is a great time to like, subscribe, and win $100 in cryptos. The next way to earn from NFTs is NFT-powered yield farming. Users can now farm for yields with AMMs that are driven by NFTs, as NFTs are quickly becoming a key component of AMMs in general. As a result, combining different DeFi protocols can help you get the most out of your digital assets. Return farming is the term for this type of farming. We'll use the Uniswap platform as an example to show how the LP NFT tokens offered as liquidity provider tokens on Uniswap can be used as collateral or staked on other protocols to earn additional yields. Then comes investing in NFT startups. When it comes to making money from NFTs, investing in NFT companies is an excellent strategy. NFTs can be used to earn money indirectly when investing in NFT companies. If non-fungible tokens have proven anything in the crypto world, it's that they're not a fad. They have a wide range of uses in a variety of industries, and they have the potential to change the world. In the crypto market, several promising NFT startups are making significant progress. It would be fantastic if you could invest in them as they take their first steps towards a revolutionary future. And finally comes Airdrop, which is the easiest way of earning through NFTs. Let's get into this feature with an example from the most popular NFT in the world right now. And if you've seen our previous videos, then you must know it's Bored Ape Yacht Club. Having that people got free airdrops of ApeCoin as mentioned earlier and those airdrops went for thousands of dollars. Like people got 10,000 ApeCoins free and then the price of one ApeCoin went on to the highs of $39. And that means a free $390,000. Doesn't that sound like something that can help people live their life freely? And all of this can be attained by owning one single NFT. But people get scammed too, so you have to research thoroughly to find out about the project whose NFT you're going to buy. You need to watch this video that I post on the screen next before you start implementing any of these ways to make money with NFTs to make sure you understand exactly what NFTs are, what you can do with them, and to start using them in the correct way. Can't wait to see you in the next video.